I just woke up half an hour ago. I just breastfed my baby girl and now we are running to the doctor, uh, to our new pediatrician. Most probably we're gonna have another vaccine for our baby girl. Uh, it's gonna be a hepatitis B. So I'm gonna be showing you everything, what we're gonna do today. I decided to make a video 24 hours with newborn. I already pumped milk for our baby girl so she can eat on the way. Our sweetheart. Ah. <laughs> She's going to see pediatrician today. We're gonna take this one to our doctor, new doctor. I'm taking breast pump with us in order to pump on the way. If she's gonna get hungry or if we're gonna stop somewhere. I don't like uh, to breastfeed in public. Brand new mama looks like this, sleepy, because I slept only four hours, but I have a plan to sleep during the day, we'll see. It's already 8.20 and I don't have time to eat, so I'll try to make some sandwich, some mess here because I was cooking last night and I didn't have power to clean, so let's go for sandwich, I have two minutes. <gasps> That's my breakfast, <laughs> bread, um, cheese and butter and I'm gonna have this uh, cheesecake and that's it. No, I don't have time to finish all of that so I decided to take banana, I'll eat it in the car. Running, running. <gasps> I'm returning back because I forgot nipple shields. Done. Here I have the box for sterilized things. I took them from that box and let's run where are the keys very good question run rabbit run <laughs> that's the look for today i have to run jumping into the car <laughs> my love my love second breakfast for our baby girl look at this cute toy switch i got from Amazon. Our father is over here. Cute, cute and handsome father. <laughs> I don't know if you can talk, uh, if you can say about the guy cute, but handsome. <laughs> he is handsome. This girl looks exactly like her father. Do you want to see what mama has in her backpack? Little shoes, red wipes, diapers, breast pump, one C, then some papers from <laughs> the hospital when I was delivering the baby. Here I have some uh, uh, diaper bags and uh, papers for the doctor where we will we'll go right now. And uh, I suppose to have, yes, pets, so they are here. <laughs> Our baby girl gained <laughs> one kilogram. <laughs> and she has grown four centimeters. Now we are at the doctor's office. Here's the place where they waited her. Here's the father. They asked me to fill up uh, this form. So it's uh, some questions uh, for the women who deliver babies and they might suffer depression. So wherever I go, <laughs> they always ask me to fill this questionnaire. We arrived to a restaurant, we're gonna have breakfast. And our baby girl also will have breakfast. She just had vaccine hepatitis B in the second dose. She was growing a lot. <laughs> so I'm gonna feed her right now. I just pumped in the car. This is how our baby is resting. <laughs> I just fed her from the bottle. And here is Max. Thank you. We come here quite often to have breakfast, so I know what I'm gonna order, and I already ordered a juice. I ordered it like usually, <laughs> vegetable omelet and pancakes. Max ordered chicken panini. I'm gonna have a bite. I ordered it a uh, red velvet cake, and Max started to attack it. <laughs> Despite I ordered it for myself. Stop it! Stop it! Oh, your is calling. After the restaurant, I went to the pharmacy. I bought pacifiers 
and I bought shampoo. I want to try new shampoos. But the most important, I bought pacifiers and we'll see if my baby girl gonna take it. Max drove back home and he took Evelyn with him. He fed her because we had some milk in the fridge. And uh, I'm just gonna wash the bottles. I'm gonna sterilize everything and then we'll see if she's gonna like my new purchase. I bought this shampoo today in the pharmacy. If you know these brands, please <laughs> write it down what you think. Should I buy it next time or not? And here's the second one. They both cost something like $10 each. Also, write it down in the comment section <laughs> if you know these brands and you like it or not. I'm really curious. Here are those new pacifiers and my bottles. And here, more. I have uh, Avent uh, sterilizer. I'm really happy with this one. So here, the first layer, second layer, water, and let's start. So approximately five minutes, and it's gonna be sterilized completely. Her baby put her in bed, but she's not sleeping. That's probably she was waiting for me. <laughs> My love. It is already 3.50. I haven't slept yet. I'm pumping milk right now for my baby girl and I'm planning to go to sleep but Max said that he wants to go to play golf. So I'll be still watching our baby girl but in the evening Max will be watching her and I will have some time for myself. I haven't figured out what I'm gonna do because I have so many plans and I'm so happy that right now I'm sitting and pumping milk and I can do whatever I want. Great thank you to my sweet husband who bought me this expensive breast pumps and uh, I am not connected to any virus and uh, I just can sit and uh, I can walk, I can do whatever. So I'm so sleepy but I need to get those friends empty. <laughs> I just pumped milk so here Yes, 120 and we're gonna put it in the bottle and our daddy will watch the baby girl. First time I got 120. Wow, from one side, from the right side. Now I have two bottles, two by 80, <laughs> so I can run away from the house for four hours. I can go to beauty salon, I can meet girls, whatever. And Max allowed me today. My baby girl woke up. Right? <laughs> Do you want to eat? I am breastfeeding my baby girl right now. She is the one who is making sound of joy. I like the way our father figured it out yesterday how to change the diaper. Look, <laughs> He put on the plate Jen, uh, this uh, changing pad and he was changing her when she was uh, playing with these toys because uh, changing table is uh, in our room and I was sleeping there yesterday. <laughs> so I told him, please don't go to the room when I'm sleeping. This person is extremely happy right now. <laughs> you see, she's powerless because she ate a lot. <laughs> Look, I'm testing new pillow. So we bought this pillow so she would not turn her head to that side because she's doing that quite often. But I don't know, it doesn't work. <laughs> she's still turning. She's trying, you see, she's trying to turn to that side because she likes that side more than this side. I also got this one. So let's try this one and let's see if this one will work better. Now let's see this one. Is this one gonna be working? <laughs> no, this one is not working. She's still turning to that side. Yeah, this one is not gonna work. So I'm gonna return this one. And now you see the, her reaction. She doesn't like it at all. I put her in a bouncer just in order <laughs> to calm her down because she really didn't like that green pillow. I figured out that my baby girl was hungry even I was feeding her from my breasts 
and there were some leftovers but I realized that she is really hungry so I got the bottle out of the fridge and I started to warm it up of course I didn't know how to use our warmer so I called Max and he has heard her crying and he said like mm, she's crying yesterday you were shouting at me because she was crying like there is no tomorrow and I was like please tell me very fast how to warm the bottle <laughs> So he taught me and voila, she's eating right now. She's having her meal, dinner, <laughs> delicious dinner, but dinner is all the time the same. Now she's resting after a delicious meal. <sighs> ah, I love it. Mm, so cute, my baby girl. Max is doing tummy time with her. Me, I cannot because she is crying. Okay, now she is silent. Oh my god, I cannot. The doctor said yes, she will be crying, but you have to be patient with her for five minutes. You have to be careful because she cannot breathe. Go, 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 go. Max was doing with her tummy time, she was screaming a lot and now, you see, she has learned how to eat pacifier. I'm so, so happy because before she was like choking and I was like, what? I bought so many and already Amazon delivered more pacifiers for her just now and it is 7 p.m. Right, my sweetheart. And you see, we put this saddle that she would not put her head to this side because we want her hat look nice. Yes, my love. My love, my love. The father is feeding our baby girl. Amazon just delivered pacifiers, so I checked them when I was walking from downstairs. So this one, it seems to me this one can be good <laughs> because this one from zero months to three months and look, it's pretty tiny. And our girl is only one month old. This one is from zero to six months. But look how huge this one. So I don't know. Maybe I'll send this one back. Or maybe I'll keep it. We'll see. Look, I started to open this one. And look at this bottle's breast milk bottle. <laughs> That's so cool. Let me just uh, reduce the lightning. So you would see it better. Yeah, <laughs> nice. I think we're gonna get this one. <laughs> I saw that many of my friends were using these bottles. I'm gonna sanitize bottles again and pacifiers. Here we go. Let's do that like this. Hop, hop, hop. I just washed my hair with new shampoo, so we'll see how it's gonna look like tomorrow. And um, unfortunately, my eyelashes are falling off because I have some irritation on this eye and uh, it was puffy for a few days. I wanted to remove them, but I decided to keep them and I'm gonna remove them during the week, mm, unfortunately. But what to do? Uh, I talked to my dermatologist and he said it's all because hormonal disbalance. He said, maybe you can do that in one month, two months. I'm like, mm, so upset. But I liked uh, when they made a uh, big volume for me. LV is ready to work, so it is a pump time. Now it is 9.56. Father is feeding Evelyn. <laughs> so basically we feed her every two hours. Sorry, my hair is still wet. <laughs> it is still night <laughs> and I'm trying to dry my hair and I'm gonna be watching uh, uh, movies. This is the first time in the whole month that I will be sitting in front of TV and I will be watching and I will be resting. So I decided, okay, I'll stay awake until 11 or 12, but at least it will be a time for myself. So I wanted to share with you what the pediatrician said today. So our new pediatrician said that we have to do some exercises 
uh, for our baby girl so we have to pull her hands and uh, bring it to her chest and uh, same with legs then uh, we have to do tummy time and he was uh, explaining to us how to do tummy time and I said you know you can explain it to the father because when we are doing tummy time my heart is just uh, uh, is Pour in, <laughs> in small pieces because she's crying and I can't see her crying but I understand that this is right and we have to make her muscles strong but I don't know <laughs> I cannot I just cannot so Max was doing today and I just came to the living room and I'm like what are you doing to the baby and he's like calm down I'm doing time with time I'm like okay I'm gonna go to another room because I don't want to hear that so we also did today a vaccine, we did uh, hepatitis B and uh, we already gained uh, uh, one kg and we also have grown, she actually has grown four centimeters, I was pretty surprised <laughs> and you know like today I noticed that she has grown because when I was breastfeeding her at four or five o'clock and I was holding her head uh, when she was drinking milk from my breast and I'm like why my hand is getting so numb but uh, yes she gained one kg so in pounds it's approximately two or three pounds maybe two and a half something like that we agreed that I would rest today <laughs> Max will take care of uh, Evelyn but he told me you cannot do that because I'm just like every single minute I'm going and checking on her and despite uh, they are in another room and Max was like okay just go and relax because yes because of the tension and because of the stress and because of physical uh, tension I become grumpy and I become angry and every single day I'm just like you do this, this wrong you do that wrong and uh, Max was like he needs some rest <laughs> because you are too much <laughs> and yes um, I have to admit that that I was really grumpy this week I also have incredible back pain and when I just delivered the baby and we came home from the hospital and I had incredible pain first few days I was massaging my back but then I stopped because uh, the pain became aka minor but still there was some pain but now I have lots of pain and uh, I do have to do some massage maybe I'll do it tomorrow I talked with the pediatrician about uh, breastfeeding you know I'm not that type of uh, women who just has butterflies in her stomach and oh breastfeeding oh we have connection with the baby no I'm not about that you know I do that because I understand that uh, uh, this milk will give her strength and uh, it will make your immune system strong but it's not because uh, I'm just enjoying that so much and I talked today to a pediatrician and I was like you know I feel like I'm already done with it and he said you should quit if you feel that uh, it makes you stressed and he was like you have to enjoy your life you have a newborn baby and you have to enjoy life with her it shouldn't be a huge struggle for you and I liked his point and uh, I just think maybe I will be breastfeeding until three months when she will be three months old or when she will be uh, approximately two four months and you know I intentionally posted that in Instagram because I wanted others uh, opinions and I knew opinion of all the people from my country so they were like no how can you do that you're selfish you shouldn't quit you have to feed the baby now until she will be one year old guys come on this is so freaking painful and you always uh, have to think that you have to feed the baby uh, every two hours and sometimes uh, every hour and uh, if I have pain when uh, she is drinking milk from my breasts I'm just pumping and still it's painful so why to have this sacrifice I don't understand I had to cover my head with the towel because my hair is still wet and guys are sleeping already and the AC here is very strong so I 
cannot switch off AC because it's pretty hot in that room. So I'll continue tomorrow. You see how much milk I have, so at least one day I can have some rest <laughs> once in a month. It's almost 12 o'clock, but I'm so white. <laughs> That's why I put so many stickers, 40 ml, in order to sanitize milk. Sanitized. <laughs> sanitized. And not sanitized. Only this one is sanitized. I'm watching a TV series called Charmed, <laughs> the TV series from my childhood. <laughs> but this one is updated version, aka update. This one was uh, shot in 2022 or 2021, but I was watching those ones which were shot in 90s. I am under the blanket and I have towel on my head. This is me, but because uh, the AC is running, that's why I have to cover my head with the towel, so I would not get sick. I have lots of responsibilities. <laughs> Happy kid at 9.25 in the morning. We put her in play gym and look, she really enjoys it. She is looking at those uh, toys. <laughs> now she sees the contrast. Oh, it looks uh, like she wants to eat. But she ate one hour and a half ago. She just woke up. She's... 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 I gave her a pacifier <laughs> so she would calm down a little bit while Max is warming up the milk. He's going to feed the baby. <laughs> when 30, mom put her <laughs> pumps to charge and she's going to sleep again. I just ate and now I'm going to sleep because during the week I didn't sleep at all. I was sleeping only 4-5 or five hours, maximum 6. One day of the week I slept 6. But yes, I can't fall asleep easily. So today I'm pumping milk and Max is feeding the baby and I'm sleeping. So I just pumped milk and that will be enough for the next feeding. And uh, then he will wake me up in three hours. Oh, and it's raining today. And maybe I'll see one of my friends tonight. She's my neighbor actually, almost. <laughs> she is... Uh, one kilometer away, approximately 10 minutes to walk. Next time I'll show you that we moved this bed a little bit closer to the bathroom and we put the creep and uh, we still have the path over there. So if one person is sleeping, so another person can walk around and take the baby. So you don't have to walk along the bed. I know, I'm talking as if I'm retarded, but I don't have power at all. So sleepy. Now we are doing tummy time. Father is doing. I just woke up and I've heard he is craving. <laughs> That's why he is always doing it when I'm not present. <laughs> My sweet baby girl. Now mama's turn to feed <laughs> the girl. I'm still pumping milk and I just put half here and I'm feeding her. <laughs> My sweetheart. We went to see my friends, uh, actually our neighbors, and now we just came home. We washed her and you see how hungry the kid is. <laughs> and uh, she likes to take shower, bathroom, <laughs> no, bath, 